This will be a 140 Q&A practice test. Plaintiff Attorney Mr. Scott, capital S-C-O-T-T. -T. Defense Attorney Ms. M.S. period Diaz, capital D-I-A-Z. And we'll start with the plaintiff. Ready? And with your hands, when did you first notice any symptoms? When I had three months working there with him, that's the first thing I noticed. My fingernails were destroyed. Did you see any doctor for that? No, but I was just about ready to see him because I had a lot of pain. Did you ask for special kind of gloves from your employer? Sometimes we grab the one that they have at the restaurants, but still it didn't work. Now, right before you started working for Ron Sanchez, did you have any back pain or knee pain? No. And did you have any problem with your hands? No. Did you ever tell Ron to find a different kind of chemicals or solutions? Yes, but he told me he had his own brand of degreaser that he wanted to use at that time. Did you discuss the condition of your hands when you discussed this chemical? I told him that, but he told me, oh, that's normal, that's going to happen. Did you show your hands to him? Yes, he told me that, oh, your hands look like boards, like really bad. Did you ever go to the office of Wilson Cleaning, or did you always go to the job site directly, directly to the job sites? He would only give me the supply. And the doctor you saw in West Anaheim after your accident, was it only a chiropractor? Yes. So only one doctor you saw after that accident? Yes. And how long did you treat? Three months. Did you fully recover from the injuries from the accident? Yes. What was the name of the chiropractor you saw? The name I don't remember. Which city? West Anaheim. I think that's what I was trying to clarify. Did you see any other doctor other than the chiropractor for that accident? For this accident? For that accident, the car accident? No. So right from the scene of the accident, did you go to some doctor? No, only to the chiropractor. Do you recall the visit with Dr. Mark Rowe, the doctor that State Fund sent you to in September, that if I saw him? Do you recall that visit? Do you recall Dr. Rowe? Yes, I saw him once. Was it in the city of Banning? Yes, in the city of Banning. How long was that visit? Less than five minutes. Then he made another appointment to get some pictures of my bones. They put me in the machine, whatever, and that thing take pictures of my knees and my back. Did you go to that? Yes. Was it MRI? Yes. And did you see Dr. Anderson? Before that, yes. And where was he located? Right there in Tustin. And did he do any testing or treatment? He only asked questions and touched my knee with something, and that's it. You're talking about Dr. Anderson? Yes. When did you see Dr. Anderson? September, I don't remember the date, of 2014. Was he also on 4th Avenue? Yes. I think Dr. Rowe is on 4th Avenue. Yes. Are you talking about Roe or, no, Tustin. Right, Dr. Rowe said that he saw you on June 29th on 4th Avenue in city of Tustin. Exactly. So you're talking about that doctor who examined your knee? Yes, the one that you... 
Did you see Dr. Anderson in Los Angeles on Vine Street? No. I went to two appointments, but when I arrived, I was told that both of them had been canceled and they were going to reschedule for another day, supposedly. But eventually, you saw Anderson once? No. So you saw only Dr. Rowe? Yes. You never saw Dr. Anderson? Never. And did, after the MRI, did you see Dr. Rowe again? No. Did he ever, nobody discussed the MRI with you? Nothing. Counselor, do you have the medical reports for Dr. Anderson? What? The medical reports for Dr. Anderson. Earlier, you testified that you did not tell Ron Sanchez that you wanted to continue to work for him, but before he terminated you, when he was discussing this option of two jobs, at that time, did you tell him that your preference was to continue with both jobs? Yes. So after termination, you didn't tell him that you wanted to continue to work for him, correct? No. Is that correct? Correct. So basically, you discussed with Ron this option that he gave you that you had to pick one job, correct? Yes. And you picked the restaurant job? Yes. So your termination was like mutual understanding, correct? Yes. I have nothing further. Did Mr. Sanchez tell you that if you chose the other job that you could not continue working for him? Yes. So in a way, he was giving you an ultimatum that if you chose the other job or continued to work at the other job that you couldn't work for him? Right, the word list. Ron Sanchez, capital R O N, new word, capital S A N C H E Z. Wilson Cleaning, capital W I L S O N. New word, capital C-L-E-A-N-I-N-G. West Anaheim, capital W-E-S-T. New word, capital A-N-A-H-E-I-M. Mark Rowe, capital M-A-R-K. New word, capital R-O-W-E. State Fund, capital S-T-A-T-E. New word, capital F-U-N-D. Banning, capital B-A-N-N-I-N-G. Dr. Anderson, capital A-N-D-E-R-S-O-N. MRI is all caps, capital M, capital R, capital I, no periods, no spaces. Tustin, capital T-U-S-T-I-N. Fourth, Avenue, capital F-O-U-R-T-H, new word, capital A-V-E-N-U-E. -E. Vine Street, capital V-I-N-E, capital S on street, Vine Street.
And that's it for the word list. And that will conclude our 140 Q&A practice test.